Hi everybody, Kiasha here. Sorry, long time, no see. Uh, life has been really crazy, so I just wanted to come on here and do a quick update video. Uh, today, I'm exactly five weeks postpartum. So I'm just going to give you guys a rundown of uh, what happened. In my last video, I was in the hospital. I ended up being in the hospital for three weeks before I had the babies. Uh, I had placenta previa, started bleeding, uh, lost almost half the blood in my body, had to have a blood transfusion, ended up getting pulmonary edema. Um, it was just really, really crazy and a lot going on. It was really kind of bad, very serious, but we made it, so we're okay. Um, the doctor didn't think I would make it to 35 weeks uh, pregnant or 36 weeks even. So they scheduled me for a C-section at 35 weeks, ended up having them at 34 weeks and five days because I started bleeding again with huge blood clots. So it was crazy. Um, they were born on May 8th at 751. Hudson was born at 751 and Harlow was born at 754. They were both four pounds, five ounces each. Hudson was 18 inches long and Harlow was 17 and three fourths inches long. Um, they were very, very healthy babies um, for them to be so premature. Um, they didn't need any IVs or any heart monitoring or lungs. I mean, everything was completely um, together. They did go to NICU. Um, they didn't take them up there right away. So we were able to see them while I was, you know, still in the um, surgery room, operating room, um, take pictures and all of that good stuff. But they did end up taking them up to NICU. Harlow was in there for 10 days and Hudson for 14. They were in there um, based on feeding. I hope this is still recording. It is. Sorry. The camera light just went off. And so I didn't know if it was still recording or not. But they were in there for feeding. Um, you know, being able to eat. So they were on feeding tubes for a minute. And then they were being bottle fed until they can um, eat enough. Uh, milliliters per feeding before they could be released so that was the only thing that was going on with them besides that they are perfectly healthy little babies little baby boy and little baby girl um harlow is right here i don't know if you guys are seeing her she's knocked out hudson is downstairs with his dad um so I'm going to do a labor and delivery video. I don't know when. I've been trying to get these videos done every day. I'm like, I need to do a video. I need to do a video. And the time just gets away from me. As you can imagine, having two babies um, pumping like crazy because they were so little, they didn't latch on. So I'm pumping around the clock to feed them. And it, it's just, life is just crazy. Um, So I don't know when I'm going to get those videos on, but I'm I'm definitely want to get them done they are on plan and i just don't know when so i just wanted to give you guys a quick little update let you know we are okay we are here um oh as far as weight i gained a total of 19 pounds the whole time i was pregnant and as of today i am down 43 pounds um, I have no idea what's going on and why I'm dropping a weight like this, but I'm happy with it because I had gained uh, a good chunk amount of weight prior to getting pregnant with all the hormone uh, hormone medicine and everything. So I'm pretty much back to almost regular weight. I just need to lose about maybe 10 more pounds, 10 to 15, tone it up. I don't act, you know, that's all I want to do is just tone it up. So just been walking um, I want to start walking more, and then next week, I guess I'm going to start really getting exercising and all of that other good stuff. Um, just to let you know, I mean, if you guys want to know anything else about me being pregnant and what happened, it was just a lot of serious going on. Let me know in the comments, and I'll do a full rundown video on that kind of stuff. But um, as of now, I'm good, I'm healthy, everything is you know, going good, healing right, uh, haven't been back to the doctor or emergency. So thank God for that. Until the next time, see you later. Bye.